So we are Kogaleo uniform. This is a small kiss and boot. It is no other from Ganjan. I got there, they like it's only 36 points, and we have 35 points. Hi everyone, Ika Malam Gushengi and Wam Nulani, Ipuma is called Kodamanjin Kaila Ran Peg. I've come a long way and I didn't get to do medicine during his physical army. My training in the chemistry, but through all the challenges, the chemistry will get me that doctor in front of my name. This is my story. Come join me. Nkula, um, yeah, I was able to get the money from the government. We didn't have electricity to get the money. 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 We didn't have electricity to get uniform Inform a yoda, a big up soon. Marble born would cushion him in a unfun, a banya aband, baby shinch, who born a ting a week at Lazincha, when a fan lazy cook, a lizard at Lolez, Manga Siso is Tatulo, which I'm begube e slippers. Eat ego, Lele Lula foot, was all go and a loose a lick cooker, who's a gube by a pumela eighteen wood told. Go to a gay is a gunjal, Sifun de I'm a metric exams. My pass a So, Baba, I see. So, I'm a so 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 i am and then bang advice we sing in the EPSC just for one year and reapply for a medicine the following year. E application fee, yeah, I got the 160 rand. So that application form gang is in a qualis, but basing a wukon we submit a cause the good agent is aval. And the guabang on good sigu beganjalo cause asking as been a malu which is well more because as such as I go on a limali, yes, I'm bang I. So you get in the last we any application form. Official bus as I sat in an online sit down, not a bad. 
asazangwa internet kwa kuti you know Okay, so in cutting bill, I'm moving bill in a form like in his face. To king to call said in his face, saying he has been around in his face. Messing him before registration, I remember. So I left home, and I was waiting at P and I was waking up about one, about two p.m. So I passed a plume for change of young about ten or so. I don't have accommodation. I'm getting a big suitcase and a sponge, packed in a in a blanket, and my metric certificate. No register. Then I registered in a taller student card. Um, after that, go back and get my accommodation. Go to the lab. But fortunate enough, my shangana niye inga nengelwe si kona ba funa umunda ba zoshara nae eflatin. Um, then ngalinda, and then I remember on the 28th of Feb, my birthday, I received an email from Mintek and the subject is be followed to pass a rewarding letter. Oh, best birthday gift ever. So I got him in Jack Bazaar. So I canceled when it was So they paid for my third year. And then I did honors. They paid for your honors. And after honors, um, decided to do a master's. So I did a master's. And then, I was at Kalim Sevenzin, because I was at the album Sevatala, and I was able to do a type on that. I made a city mile pay. So yeah, last year, 2016, I joined Mintech is a, 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 a graduate program which takes about 15 months um then once you graduate again then here i am in the scientist economy uh, okay then um after my bsc chemistry degree um i decided to do honors and then I graduated, and then I went for master's degree. I graduated with master's. Um, because I'm in tech, based on assessor for if I'm doing a PhD, since I'm not covering any master's, I'm getting a PhD in chemistry. Sasa uya u interview. Gemfisela inkanta. U interview ya kesi ngatiti anikumelela. Ngoba sisi boni le wote pumelela kwa akibu pumelela we family asikai kuko wanga wenza utaba ngati na kwa so ngemfisela simfisela inchanga u interview ya Texas. Um, if unga tola i i funding for me minta kigwenzi PhD, um, this will mean a lot to me as um. I might have not been a doctor by a profession, but I will hold a title about doctor. So this is just going to mean a lot to me and my career. Any other things that perhaps you know of that could cause a precipitate? Silica is one of them.
Welcome to us. Uh, my name is Michael Makabani from the HR division. I would like to introduce to you Sandra Graham. She can just uh, introduce herself as well. Hi, Lingui. I'm Sandra Graham. I'm the head of R&D and training in the analytical services division. So the purpose of this gathering is to assess you for the buzz that you have applied from our organization for your postgraduate degree and only to see that you meet our standards. I'm going to ask you uh, some few questions from the human resources perspective and Sandra here will ask you some questions also from the scientific point of view. Uh, I will start with my first question. Uh, tell me, thank you, what do you see your role being in the next five years within the uh, science faculty? Um, if I can get this passari, I'm going to do my PhD studies. Um, maybe that will take me about two to three years. And then I'm going to be a doctor. And having me, um, having uh, done the PhD study, obviously I'm going to get more skills and I'm, I'm going to be more skilled in the science field and know more um, about the research. Um, so I'm, I'm hoping and that I'm going to be a research scientist um, in the next five coming years. And I'm going to be, um, or I'm going to make sure that um, I help my other colleagues to grow more in the science field. Um, yes, with regards to research and developing new methods. Okay, Lingui. So imagine you're doing your project on um, scandium determination and you fuse the sample using the sodium peroxide, sodium carbonate fusion. And when you leach it in acid, um, you have a, a milky precipitate. How, how do you think you would deal with that? Um, in most cases, if you have a milky precipitate, it means um, maybe some silica in your sample has dropped. Maybe you have overfused your sample. So first thing that I, I would do, I would take the sample and put it on the hot plate just to heat it up. And if it doesn't still get clear, and then I'll just add the hydrogen peroxide. Please. Okay. Um, any other things that perhaps you know of that could cause a precipitate? Silica is one of them. Um, okay, if the silica is dropped and also if you have overfused your sample and maybe if um, you didn't get the clear uh, melt, so your sample has had not been, um, been digested completely, so you can still have some of the precipitate in it. I think we're going to allocate three tasks for you and we're going to provide the mentor and those three tasks will determine whether you are successful in this uh, puzzle application or not. So good luck going forward. Thank, Thank you so much. Thank you. Ka nne te more tswang teng ha go mo mo re ya nteng o tla mea go tseba pallo ya hao ene hape ha e ka pele ha hao e ka ga re go wena she ba diketso tsa hao ba tla tsela e tla go isang pallo ya hao ene hape o bane le maitshwaro ha e le hlengiwe o ghetheile o tseba ditaba tsa hae o tla mea fela ho nka maikutlo a hae a wa beka tla sa ga taolo ho kena le ka leng nela national senior certificate ena le exemption e tla o dumela gore o yetse degree national senior certificate fela o ka etsa di costa money go take Maths, le physical science di compulsory gore o tlhole mosebetsi o tla mea gore o bane le yona diploma ka pa degree mona he thutjo ya honka e go be se bakeng sa ba ghetheileng ma haslase se ba gore pallo efe ka pa efe go na le ho etla go kosang teng hello my name is Josiah Mduli i'm the superintendent in the analytical services division I've been at Mintech for the last six years and I'll be a mentor to Teng Yue today. Did you read your sample? Uh, not really.
What are we going to do today, hustlers? The same thing we do every day. Try to take over the world. What are we going to do today, hustlers? The same thing we do every day. Try to take over the world. Welcome to task one. In task one, I'm going to give you one solid sample. In that solid sample, I want you to determine base metal on it. Okay. Are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Let's go. So why did you decide to become a scientist? Uh, from the young age, um, when I was at primary and also going to high school, I really enjoyed um, maths and science. And um, I guess it was just curiosity um, based on the experiment that we did in high school. And I wanted to find out more and know more what's exactly what's happening in there. My interest in science, okay, was inspired by my teacher uh, in grade eight, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, he passed away, unfortunately. But he used to, you know, group us, okay, this 60 and up below this particular class, 65 and above this particular class, you know. So it inspired that competition, you know, if you do science, you know, you're sharp, you're good. Uh, when I was doing my third year, um, we used to watch TV a lot because we didn't have a lot of work to do. And then we'd watch uh, the detective shows like CSI. At a certain point, I saw myself doing one of those things, you know. Um, I'm weighing my flux and then I'm going to add it to the sample, mix it and take it for fusion. Okay, excellent. Sodium peroxide, I'm weighing 1.5 gram. Okay, good. So now I'm done weighing my sample. I'm going to take it for fusion now. Okay. I'm going to sponsor a check. So in the end, I'm and then I had to apply for NEFSAS as well. You know, because say TEFS and it's a scat. So TEFS are sponsored my, my studies. Okay, thank you. Are you ready for the next step yes, of I'm task ready. number one? Yes. Okay, you know what I want? I want you to fuse that sample and then we're going to leach it. Do you know how to fuse? Yes, I do. Please proceed. Remember, you must put your sample on your pants and burner first. Yes. So don't contaminate your sample. Okay. Right, good. So now why do you fuse your sample? I'm fusing my sample to digest it, to get it into um, solution. Remember, it's solid and our instrument can't read the solid sample. Good stuff. Can I check? Please come check. All right, I'm happy. I think you can switch this thing off. Be careful. Right, awesome. So now I've added some water. I'm gonna have to go and add the hydrochloric acid. Okay. Remember? Um, I would say yes. We were naive, to be honest. We didn't even know what to do from Ekaya. Because the guy was like, I'm going to go to the house. And then I was telling you, I'm going to go to the house. Just here.
All right, can you hear me? Let's check. Is your fusion complete? Yes, it's complete. Okay. My solution is clear. Okay, now I'm, I'm done diluting my sample. We're now gonna go to the instrument for readings. I did that when through a selection test, but I had to explain. But after that, I to understand that I was able to support and go. to create uh, just bear in mind that all these racks are numbered okay make sure that you put your sample on the correct rack so that you don't get incorrect results by reading the wrong sample okay, okay. so let's go ahead okay so the instrument is initializing now so let's check that everything is still in order The instrument has started. It's only going to take us about uh, less than two minutes. Less than two minutes to read yeah, the sample. To read okay. the sample. So make sure that you close this cage because you don't want acids to fill up the lab. So you said, what do you expect on this sample? I'm expecting around about 0.9% copper. of copper and around about 23% of iron. Did you read your sample? Uh, not really. Um, we put the wrong position okay. in, um, in the program. So we're going to have to reread the sample. Okay. But it's Please only going to take about a minute. Stop whatever program. the instrument is doing and reread your sample. Okay. In task one, I think I did well, um, especially with the preparation part and up to the instrumentation part where we analyzed the sample. Although um, one mistake happened that we didn't put the correct position in the system so that the auto sampler goes to the correct sample to read. But everything went well. Uh, I'm sure you won't do this again. So when we do the next task, so we need to make sure that we put the correct position on the sample racks. Okay, but this is fine. I'm happy with what I've seen. Mona rebona o tlamea go bana le elo tlhoko ka nako tsohle. Go bana di chemical compositions ke go nepa ha di measurement le go latelana ha tsona. Ene ntho e shebilweng mo na kareng ena. Go go tshepa hala ha hao le maikemiso tsa a go yetsa dipatlisiso le go rarolla mathata a ene gore a kopa kopane. Ho nka information e link technically we tlhalosetse motho ene gore ha technically. Tshebediso ya laboratory le go sebedisa technology ka go tibileng. Ma haslase gore o gole e tswa ditabeng tsa hao tsa tlwaelo. Go bana wena ha dumela gore wa gona hala e ya wa gona hala emba ha o sa dumeli ho fela jwalo okay oops too much all right Hi, Hi, Josiah. Okay, I've just received the sample from Bio. They want you to do an oxide leach on it. Everything is in the balance room. Okay. Just make sure that you've checked your balance and you've checked the room temperature before. Okay, so we're only sample. leaching oxide copper. Oxide copper this Not time. Not cyanide. No cyanide copper. Okay. Ready? Yes, I'm ready. Okay, let's go. 
Um, I will. I have to label my sample because it's important for traceability. So we must know what sample we are working on, and the result also to trace it on the instrument. Excellent. Um, so for this task, we are gonna analyze for sequential copper, right? Meaning it's oxide copper, cyanide copper, and the residual. That's um, correct. Following the SOP for this task, we normally weigh about 0.25 gram. Okay. So I'm weighing the sample now. So you must make sure that you put all that information in your workbook. Okay, I'll do so. I'm a Venus Gababa. I am a in the main school and Bilo Nyamne. Also, Charlie Jolly will say education is important in Bilo Nyako. He's been to Joe Beg, who won it with Lamanto Mazani, Achele Ekaya, Anga Fundile, and Bilo Abai Bilula. But Muzo Emma Tolopena Makulu and Ufundil on education in Peloyakis of Ilon. So Ulta Lindy Mengul. Okay, I'm done weighing the sample. Okay, what are we doing now? Um, we've weighed uh, the sample, we weighed 0 0.5. We're going to add our lexivient. Then after adding 10 mil, what are you going to do? You put it on the shaker for about two minutes. All right. So while it shakes, it leaches out the oxide copper. Okay. Okay. Oops, too much. So now we're going to shake it for about two minutes. All right. So the process will be complete in two minutes? Yes, in two minutes. Okay. Uksif Tawami from AKZN is a free state. It's a good challenge in Akulu and AKZN has now been able to be a Sutu and free state. It's just Sutus, Tuanas, Africans and English. But I was born in Sutu my first year. I was born in Sutu my first year. I was fluent in Sutu. So, I am in the Department of Water Affairs. In the sense that we have to be able to do this, we have to be able to do this, and we have to be able to do Because we have to be able to do this, we have to So, we have to be able to do this, we have to be able to do this, and if we have to be able to do this, I analyze all the technique engine. So we are going to communicate with our client and we are going to go advice and buy asset. So I'm done leaching out the oxide copper. Now I'm going to come here. This is the centrifuge um, okay. instrument that we use to separate the liquid and the solid. Yeah. Then you press that. In Kula, a begung a kolul isn't always in Zima. Like, we should go a uniform A1 for him to As long as he has a tabu, he has a swang eye in a And I'm sure I have a photo that he paid the color, you know. But no one na anga zengi stabangu ti. So when drive him out or when he, so seven zero calling, call a flat fee, no when he went zagalan. And I guess mo ingane, you get used to a situation e kona kaya and. Unalog, as long as we leave and buy a tanda, they tell you every day which is a tanda and back near low 50 cent your care and uba right, but uba honest and guys in his bona guti, nim nine, is a primary guti, I'll be this something to my scientist one day.
Let's check now. Is everything still in order? Yes, okay. um, the center fridge is done. So I'm just going to check if our sample separated. Okay. Go ahead. Good. So what's the next step now? I'm just going to transfer my sample to the volumetric flask and dilute it uh, to the mug with water. So with your residual copper, what would you normally do on that residue? You take the residue and transfer it into a beaker and you add acid, so you do acid digestion. Oh, okay. What acid are you going to use? Uh, you use a mixture of hydrochloric, nitric and perchloric acid. Um, now we're done leaching, so we're going to take this to the instrument for analysis. We're going to use AA in this case. Good. Ignite the flame. Right. Make sure you don't look through the flame because of UV visible light, okay? You know it's dangerous for your eyes, okay? So you must always keep that shield intact. Don't move it. So we're gonna read the sample manually. Okay. So now I'm gonna start reading the sample. Yep, let's read and see. And test two, the most it was not really challenging, but the challenging part was um, now analyzing the results that you got, because um, it just gives you the copper. But now you must analyze back to your sample and determine that this is the oxide copper, and you must know um, what copper minerals there are oxides. So once you get the result for that copper, you have to sit down and analyze the result before you get back to the client and tell him. So you don't just take the results that, in, that, that is in the instrument. You take the results and then you sit down, you do some calculation, and then you get back to the client and say, the oxide minerals that are in your samples are this and this and this and this. So it's a bit challenging. So you can here. Put your sample ID. So, yeah. Okay, we got what we were expecting. Okay. It's less than 0.1%. Okay. Yeah. Excellent. All right, I'm happy with what I see. I think this is the end of task number two. I think now we are ready for task three. Okay. Kala ho karia ena, uta sebeta ko laiboro chifu na kutenga, ta imba, hanzo ohola, uta ipona osebeta ko ofisi. Mi sebeta yale kala lena, ea tibe, uta sebeta kami kuta ya batu, di scientisti, li di customer, te di linka haruhu kampani, li te di linka nintle. Ma haslase, ha o kheta karia, e chweta ora hao singwe so okasi eza nza sili tati, kante huso na seu. Dynamite comes in small packages. Utlele yoge usabe zaka masampul amangana kote ayazom kolo metlogo impilenze asabe nsa in science. Indo kazge ichwa lugo usabe nsa ama chemical formulas. Jenga abo H for hydrogen, abo O for oxygen, abo H two O for water. Kote mina gengi shange word shambo formulas ba fetu ginige zilo H nga ginige zau N. Mani sige ginige zake abo E abo B. Most lem asabe atanza lipika ama gitsumelo kumkapas kona lapena go Twitter na go Facebook. Umas muwe mbwa kefu. Indo kazabe sabe nsa gengi to end the boom goes. Get to pass up. Far danger. Nothing goes. Tina get set to careful. See you boy. Soon and very soon. We are. We were going to see you after this, man. <laughs> Which internal standard are you using? Anyway, yes, yes, I am. Are you ready for task number three? I am ready. I have just received two samples from the clinic. Okay. Those are urine samples, okay. and I want you to determine the content of uranium in those samples. Oh, okay. Are you ready? Yes, I'm ready. Okay, let's go. Here are the two samples. Okay. What dilutions are going to make from these samples? Um, we do a two times dilution okay. normally, but um, before we analyze the sample, we must digest it in the microwave. Yes, because it contains some salt. Oh, yes. 
I'm now going to prepare the sample um, to the vessel okay. so that we can digest it in the microwave. Uh, we are going to uh, 2011, after even a short stint in the NJJ company, Kony business as a science. So, as I'm humble, so I'm a year and then it was a lot of people like I love Vela and Jomo Munto, I tell my girl, I seven Zaraku, as I'm going to King of Raku, but he won't touch a So now I'm done adding the acid. I'm going to put my samples in the microwave for right. digestion. Good. I'll open that for you. Yes, please. So you put the sample in the microwave, and then this is where you insert your probe for temperature. All right. Good. OK, it's in for Friday. And then you just press that. If I'm going to leave Basar from Mintek, continue with my studies for PhD, this will like mean a lot to me. Um, since good dollar. Okay, for the PhD, I moved to Bloom. My girl is calling us or seven because I felt like my parents were saying another thing, which you know, my look value or seven, you know, and and this is why my daughter pay on seven so money or bigger day we are not receiving support. So I felt the need which many have been given seven in the school and the mothers are calling in the guy. But now as we think, as we get the school because when you finally take the robot out, okay. So if we are not able to pass out. Like it's gonna mean a lot, a lot to me. Which change the is something in good look mean, I know. And whatever I'm a skills allowing as well gain and research skills and writing up as a cool look mean and I'm gonna grow big career. Digesting. This close. Okay. okay, what are we doing now, Shanyue? Okay, now I've digested my sample. I'm going to add the internal standard uh, for interferences. Which internal standard are you using? I use iridium. Okay, good. How many meals? Just one meal. One meal, okay. This is my iridium internal standard, so I'm gonna prepare one meal. Can you please get me the caps, please? Inventory I am today, Ungsize ga kulu, mama taske beka tingnigize wana. Ukonil gusape ndula ma questions ebenge nao, ebenge mbuza wana, labenga understand the con. Okay, here are your caps. Okay, so now I'm going to place my samples. So now you'll have to put that information on there. Yes, now I'm done with the preparation. Now I just need to take this information and put it in the system. You must make sure that the position of your sample is correct. Good. So in 10 minutes we should have results, or less? Less than 10 minutes we should have results. 
In the next five years, I see myself having a doctorate. Um, yeah, because I really want to change my target to a doctor. I see myself um, being appointed as a research scientist. Um, I see myself supervising other people so that they can gain more skills. Um, yeah. Me now, I'm going to be a job in the in focus on the business side of the same industry. But I think we will lose And this is our results. As you can see from sample one and sample two, we have about 0.000. So there's nothing. TPP, so there's nothing. So these two employees, they are still safe. They don't contain any uranium in their bodies. Yes. So which isotope did you use, by the way? It's uranium two thirty eight. Two thirty eight. Okay. Good. Awesome. Okay. Thank you. Uh, this will be the end of task number three. Now we can go ahead with the closing interview. Oh, okay. Thank you. We gave you three tasks to perform. Uh, I would like you to tell us what was the most difficult task among the three and also what was the most uh, very, very easy task to perform. Um, the three tasks that I performed, um, I must first say they were very interesting, all of them. But the most, it was not that difficult, but it was a bit challenging. Um, the first task, task one, where I had to um, fuse the sample and just to um, sample preparation, so that I take it to ICP OES um, for analysis of base metals. Um, so we had sort of big, challenge, big challenges um, while fusing the sample and also with the leaching. But after I asked a few questions from my mentor and he made everything clear. And so anyway, after spending some time performing the three tasks, uh, how do you feel about the application for PhD bursary? Are you still interested? Yes, Sandra, um, I'm still interested in getting the funding for my PhD, especially um, after the test that I did today. Um, I've gained much interest um, in analytical chemistry and chemistry itself. And after the evaluations that we had with you and the interview sessions and all the deliberations and conversations with you, we would gladly like to offer you the bazaar to finish your PhD degree. Wow, thank you so much, guys. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. Congratulations. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. Thank you. Uh, by you accepting the offer that we are giving to you, from now on, we'll just get in touch with you and do all the necessary processes and things that must be done. And I also wish you well in your, with your studies. Thank you so much. Thank you. Just come out of my interview. Youngin toy hambega ache. Gitsolili pasari. Tengo kubegu sin calling face. Gisamu kupo am to hustlers out there. Presser, pusher, panda. We out. Well done, Shengiwe. Riboni kawe na horiki di solatse chata. Seri risa ngo di palonse chete hileng. Boto yaro na yabeke ena ito ko Francis. Ariana obata oba a financial journalist. Ha a graduate. Di journalist ba bukela meleza. Boto ko si chose ite. Ba ngole katona ba pete ba report. Horo wena obe journalist e chwa chwa. Ota me a li a good general knowledge. Obata ko tseba lugo ita di patisi so. Ota me ngola kaho ukwa halang le kaho tovileng. Wena ba la he 
ne o shebele di journalist tse tse ba halang gore o tsebe go ithuta ha e ka ba go na le ho sa utlwang go pula o chakela facebook le yona website ya rona romela ya haopotso Ooh, shame, jealous, down, mona pants, hustlers. Get your bonus, thank you. Name in tech. Happy ba funny lana. Happy ba bonana. You guys come to this. Unga buye e lalini. Gota mau seven zanzima. Now get unga zakeli kama. Ube umuto chizi. Empaga tidi. Get imagine the skills of the uzo hamba la panayo chola. I PhD yake. Na sisi bizo ngutu uto hotela. Thank you. I'm cool mo to Dr. Kumal. I'm cool mo to Dr. Love. Oh, the hotel ba mumpela. Get the swam. Get under his style of sako. Get under the Technique yako, ogus na chaga kumpe ndulo ya wechambleshi ya glevigi. Ika mara katika sisi kuna mafuti hi technique. Sasa la sile ya abai choli, la banga chola, mama musanu kacha zega. Na kuvia zaza sisi pete le anya ge iwe jungle. Na miga outi ni zetu jungle doctor mashuba diacha. Nisha ista chulo, nitonza zonke ntiambu, pumeranje. Nisha sana nikuona la pana kuto Twitter, Facebook, and also on YouTube mafuti. Nisha la kuchela ngiti. Don't look down, look up and stay up. Upegi zulu, giti giyele ningi ha, bengi eka. Yes, we win it. See ya.